the AMG GT in road form already. Front engine, rear drive, powered by a four liter twin turbocharged V8. Of course, in race trim, it's a little different. The gearbox is now a proper sequential box with six gears and an adjustable mechanical LSD in a magnesium casing. Brakes are by AP Racing with six piston calipers at the front and four pots at the rear, and the system features huge endurance pads that will only be changed once in the race. All the electronics are new, so the GT4 has fully adjustable ABS and traction control that you can quickly modify with two dials on the carbon fiber central tunnel. It also has the coolest steering wheel this side of an F1 car, trick KW suspension with bump and rebound adjustment, and 18 inch wheels with Michelin slicks or racing wets. Let's hope we only need the slicks. The race commences at 3.30 p.m. and our car is in the first of three waves that take the rolling start. Bernd is first up and will use his speed and experience to try to pick up more places. Me, I watch for a bit and then try to relax. My turn will come at 7.30 or so this evening. It's time to get proceedings underway. The green flag lap, the last opportunity for the drivers to have a look at the circuit and a chance for the fans on the Nordschleife to come the wrong side of the fence and get right up close trackside and see the cars as ever waved away in three starting groups. The fans at the marshals, trackside giving a cheery wave on the final formation lap of this 25.378 kilometer circuit that uses the Grand Prix track and the Nordschleife. It's the ultimate lap. The run along the Dürtinger Herb back up towards the Grand Prix circuit. And then to get the 46th running of the race underway. Like, I know, like, Le Mans is like a full on sprint. Is this, how would you describe this? Like, it's pretty much a sprint now. Is it? Yeah. For the top guys. And, yeah. like, we haven't been told to save the tires or anything. We have a fuel target to drive to. We're doing eight laps. They want us to try and do nine. But there is always. Bring the car back. Well, particularly early on. Like, yeah. Like, basically, you get to doors and then it's like the race yes. starts. Yes. <laughs> The 911 GT3R was leading the all Porsche duel against the two sister cars. Hubert Haupt being chased hard by John Edwards, trying to get up the inside of one of the back markers. The two touched, the Mercedes delayed and suffered damage. Okay, so about to go out with my first stim. It's coming up seven o'clock, half past seven. Um, yeah, we're past doing really good. But yeah, just go out and try and feel my way into it. I've done hardly any laps so far this weekend. So just start slow, see what happens. 